Hello, welcome to my newest YouTube video. It's been a while, but I'm back on form with YouTube now. They're gonna be more regular, I promise. I'm not gonna lie, I've been slacking. I've just been slacking. I've been busy, I've been traveling a lot. It is all over on my Instagram. I post daily there if you wanna see what I'm doing on a more regular basis, but I'm gonna be back on form with YouTube videos. Starting with this one. If you can't tell, that is a van. And it is the biggest van I've driven to date. So I was so nervous driving it um, from where I picked it up from. I had about an hour to drive to get here to Allswater, which is where I'm at now. And I was so nervous. I was driving like 30 miles an hour. Everyone probably hated me, um, but I got used to it quicker than I expected to actually. It's a really beautiful van. It's like the van of dreams, of my dreams. So I'll give you a quick tour. This is the van. It has a huge double bed at the end, it's got all the storage underneath, it's got loads of storage and everything you could kind of need included. It has got a cooker and an oven and a fridge and it even has a shower. A shower and a toilet. And that is the van, so I'm looking forward to some fun van life adventures over the next few days. I want to hike, I want to paddleboard, I want to swim, I want to enjoy the weather, I want to cook with beautiful views, which is what I'm going to do now because I'm starving. <laughs> My cute little dinner for one. Good morning, I survived my first night in the van. It was really warm, really cozy, the bed is huge and I bought my favorite big fleecy duvet from home so it was really cozy. So yeah, this is a lay-by on Alls Water. It is not an official camping spot. Uh, there are literally signs that say no camping but I'm pushing my luck and so far so good. No one's come along and told me off so this is Alls Water and just um, there's plenty of laybys along Alls Water if you were looking for a camping spot or even just somewhere to pull in and go for a swim or a paddleboard or something. Alls Water is perfect for that so I'm going to move on today to another spot. I need to decide where that will be but lovely first night on Alls Water in the van. Literally, I'm the only person on this whole lake. Honestly, best bagels ever. Seeded bun, turkey, cucumber, hummus, rocket. Chef's kiss, so good. So, driving the van for the second time, decided I'm gonna head down into Glen Ridding, which is probably only like eight or nine minutes down the road, but I've decided I'm gonna do a hike of Glen Ridding Dodd and Sheffield Pike tomorrow, and um, they start from Glen Ridding, and I might try and get up there for sunrise, so the closer I am 
for the start of the route, the better. So I decided I'm gonna head down now. Hopefully I can find a parking space. I've never parked anything this big before, so I'm hoping that it's quiet and empty. Um, but yeah, it's 6.30, I'm gonna head into Glen Ridding, park up for the night, and then plan to get an early start in the morning for tomorrow's beautiful sunny day, which I'm really excited for. So I will see you tomorrow. Here we go, here we go. time. just beat the sunrise as well. Here's Alls Water, looking incredible. Look at these views. This is like 460 something meters, I think. And you get these incredible views of Alls Water and the lakes. How did I not know this existed? So now I just wait for the sun to rise. I'm heading down from Glen Ridding Dodd. That was the nicest way to start my morning. Such a cool sunrise, such a cool um, spot to watch the sunrise from. So if you want a good sunrise spot in the lakes, that one is a banger. It only took me 51 minutes to get up and I'm quite slow. <laughs> so less than an hour up and you've got a beautiful sunrise over Allswater Lake. So definitely one to bookmark for future. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna head down. I'm pretty tired now, so I might have a nap. this lovely little spot on Coniston water. I didn't film anything yesterday because I literally got here, pulled up, sat in my deck chair and chilled for the entire day. Um, and it was just really nice to just be kind of off grid and off my phone and off camera and everything. But yeah, it's been an awesome few days. I've loved it, I've loved the Lake District. Um, there's always so much that I want to do here and there's never enough time. But yeah, so if you have any questions about anything I did or where I went, if I didn't mention things, just drop me a comment. Um, please like the video and subscribe and um, if you don't already go follow my Instagram which is Grace's Adventures that has kind of more detailed in the moment story content for you if you are interested in seeing that side of things so yeah but goodbye from me and the beautiful Lake District and my lovely van and I'll see you next time